Only on 10 TV on the eve of the six month anniversary of the train derailment in East Palestine. New concerns tonight from rail union leaders. The train derailment happened in February. In March, new safety measures became law as part of a more than $13 billion state budget. Now the Association of American Railroads is suing the state of Ohio over some of what was passed, including the legislation requiring two member crews on freight trains. John Esterly, one of the rail union leaders who fought for this safety measure, is concerned. He says the rail industry is trying to undo what was signed into law. I'm disappointed to see the lawsuit, but I'm not surprised. Uh, the railroads uh, challenge many of these uh, state level laws that deal with things that they feel are preempted by federal law. Uh, but I think, um, you know, given the right court, the right judge and, and an opportunity to plead the case that that Ohio's law can stand up. Esterly adds the push for new safety laws on the federal level has stalled in the months following that train derailment.